Assalamualaikum. Hello everyone. Uh, in this video, I want to share uh, with you uh, some simple review on uh, using iPad as part of the classroom technology. I have been using iPad since 2011 and it has become uh, a very important tool uh, I've been using in my teaching career. Uh, not only for teaching but also for my studying, for my research, uh, doing presentation and assisting students in many different ways. So uh, I have um, um, some uh, common applications that have been used for quite some time and some of them uh, are discovered uh, uh, through the course I had with Yari. For example, Arasma uh, play for virtual reality playground to uh, help students uh, coding, learning about coding. Uh, green screen these are some of the new uh, apps uh, I discovered from uh, intro course but Poplet, Socrative, uh, Explain Everything, Telegami, Padlet uh, uh, including iWork collections like Keynote, Pages, Numbers uh, are all already been used uh, for quite a long time I also use uh, Evernote a lot uh, to assist my note taking uh, as well as uh, uh, doing some annotation uh, on the PDF. Uh, even though now OneNote uh, um, has uh, many uh, new features that can be used for the same purpose, but uh, Evernote still doing it more efficiently, uh, especially uh, in uh, combining all the uh, text, uh, highlighted text uh, into one part at the beginning of PDF automatically. So I really appreciate that function. Um, um, so, uh, and, and on top of everything, uh, I will also like to highlight how important uh, Kindle and Kobo, uh, which I've been using uh, for many years uh, to help me uh, in uh, getting the access to uh, access to many books uh, because I started my career as a teacher without having uh, the, te the formal teacher training. So most of the books I read um, uh, are on Kindle. Even though I have the uh, e-reader device, um, uh, the paperwhite version of uh, Kindle, but most of the time I'm still uh, using iPad uh, to read uh, all these books. So these are some of the books I have uh, in my uh, collection. Uh, mostly related to uh, education. Okay. Uh, I also have uh, Kobo. Uh, Kobo also uh, uh, is a, a good um, platform for uh, ebooks, uh, but um, I use Kobo mainly for. Uh, my previous study in history so most of the collections I have uh, on my Kobo um, uh, are related to history even though I do have some books on education as well uh, so other than Kobo and um, Kindle I also uh, use um, uh, iBook uh, a lot uh, where is it is it here no Probably here. No, not. I can remember. Yeah, the the the, the iCloud uh, new feature related to iBook uh, has made the synchronization between uh, my iPhone and my iPad uh, for the uh, collection on PDFs uh, is very efficient now, so I really appreciate that. So these are some of the uh, uh, apps related to uh, education uh, that I've been using to assist myself and also my teaching and learning. Thank you.